Welcome to the Horizontal Framing with Metal Stud training video. We begin by choosing from the Item Assignment Toolbar, Horizontal Framing, Metal Stud Horizontal Framing, 5.5 inch horizontal members, and finally 18 gauge. Check the Auto Assign checkbox, click a new measurement, and do a clockwise area takeoff. A closer look at the quantity list reveals we need to enter the length of one side of the area that is perpendicular to the current direction of the joist, in this case, 7.5 feet. Also, since I do not care to calculate costs for framing, drywall, or insulation at this time, I will enter zero. One of the main features of the joist extension is the capability to rotate and move the member display. First, right-click in the selected area and choose Edit Extension and then Move Rotate Layout. Hold down the left mouse button and move the cursor around the area until approximately where you want it, and then hold down the Shift key to get it to snap to predetermined angles. Left-click the Check icon and remember to change the track length. As you can see, the members are changed and counted in the new rotation and react to changes in the choices. Let's go through some of the inputs and choices and see what happens. I can choose four sides or two sides with the track, studs at parallel condition edges, and more. Practice with this to see what changes with your choices. We've completed our particular takeoff. And of course, all this is updated in Excel with a single click on the Refresh Quantities item in the eTakeoff Add-in drop-down. Contact me with any questions you may have. 